Okie dokie people, how's it going? This is The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom for the Nintendo Switch. Just received my copy of the game today, launch day, and we're about to get started. Looking forward to it. Let's do it. It's a good thing I started streaming as soon as I booted up the game because... This strange bloom keeps getting thicker. We've been descending for a while now. These tunnels are deeper than I thought. What could be down here? Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. Whoa, full health cage. Yeah, controls. Yeah, well, same as usual, right? Well, let, let's save already, <laughs> I guess. Okay, title screen, special controls, options. Invert vertical camera, no, no. Aim with motion controls. Oh, well, you know what? Uh, uh, no, no, enabled, yeah, that's what I want. Swap jump controls. Assign jump to B and dash and the directions to X disabled. Oops. Just coming off of playing Assassin's Creed uh, Brotherhood. <laughs> now I need to get used again to uh, not play that game. Falling ill after coming into contact with the gloom drifting. Woohoo, New Zelda, hey Panda. Though here it seems almost misty and not concentrated enough to harm us. We'll keep going. With it coming up from beneath. Are you about to head to town? Ah, okay. I'll take you out there, uh, Panda. Woohoo! We do not know what waits below, so we need to be ready for anything. But. I know I'll be okay with you, Link. Let's go solve this mystery. Well, she doesn't walk very fast, so... There's a bit of physics going on with a uh, is a uh, what is it like a little ponytail I guess. Yeah, that's nicely done. Hmm. I never imagined this was all deep beneath Harold Castle. Uh huh. Oh, is it my sword glowing? Oh yeah. Link. The Master Sword. It must be sensing something. I knew we had reason for concern. Ever since the end of the Calamity, the castle has fallen into neglect. But I never could have imagined anything like these tunnels were hiding here. We must be careful as we move deeper. Hmm. Trying to take in the details of the scenery, trying to make sense of, the, of it all. What's this even supposed to be? Link, look here! Hmm. 
These are ruins from an ancient civilization. Wait, something is written here. Might these ruins be from the Zonai? The Zonai. Zonai? Z -Z -Z Zonai? Zonai? However you pronounce that. Yeah, 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 yeah. There are. There were a lot of these statues before. Oh, oh she she's taking pictures. <laughs> <coughs> I heard her a short noise. Ah, she has a Sheikah Slate. These carvings. Wait a minute. There's something animate. Ah, no, never mind. I thought there was something animating on the slate itself when one of her sh the shutter noise went off. These carvings. I'm sure they're a Zonai in origins. I've seen these designs like... I've seen designs like this in my studies. The Zonai are said to have lived long... To have lived long ago in the time of earliest legend. They possessed godlike powers and had a prosperous civilization in the sky. Many history books tell us about the Zonai, but none give us the full picture. Much, much is still unknown about them. Swing sword. Oh yeah, by the way, is it alright with the the overlay the way I set it or should I switch it over? No, okay, it's not covering the, the text box. That's what I was wondering about. Is this what the Zonai looked like? They seem so different than us and such large ears. How did the ruins from a civilization in the sky end up be beneath the castle? Looks like the path ahead goes even deeper. Let's continue, Link. Can I look in first person in this game? Crouching increases your stealth, making it easier to sneak up on foes and animals. Yeah. Hmm? Ah, yeah, you can send uh, waves of energy using your sword. Does it break? Well, I guess I don't have access to a menu that shows me my inventory or anything like that yet. No. Hmm. Yeah, the, the torch doesn't cast shadows. That's a bit of a... Bit of a shame. Keys! You're not hurt, are you, Link? No. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Look at these murals. The written histories of the royal family include stories of a great war fought long ago. It was a conflict between allied tribes and someone only ever referred to as the Demon King. Is it possible? Do these murals depict the same legend? This is similar to the statues we saw earlier, a Zonai. And these figures look like Hylians. This depiction certainly suggests that the Zonai descended from the heavens. It is said that my ancestors, the first of Hyrule's royal family, Born from a union with gods who had descended from the heavens. These murals tell a similar story, and if they are accurate, then the gods mentioned were the Zonai. They must have forged a relationship with the Hylians of that time, working together to establish the kingdom of Hyrule. This figure. 
We know it. He's stealing something of incredible power from the young kingdom. This all aligns with what I've read during my studies. And then this. It shows the demon king. And a fierce battle against him. If the creature depicted here really does represent the demon king, then... Incredible. This mural must be the great war recorded in the royal histories. Mm -hmm. This is the imprisoning war and the events that led up to it. Clink! This is a huge discovery. All right, then. Now to use this invention of Pura's. I'm glad I didn't leave it behind. It's so easy to record. You point it and click. Oh. Oh, it looks like the rest of the mirrors are obscured. We're gonna need bombs to clear out the way. <laughs> Can you use your Sheikah slates? Well, I don't know. I don't. I don't have it anymore. <laughs> Maybe we'll find more answers farther ahead. Link, let's keep moving deeper. Was it important? <laughs> the missing part of the mural? Does this book sound when it connects with it, when it connects with it? It doesn't do it. Yeah, it doesn't do it with the rest. It makes a different sound, so that kind of tells me that you have to clear this out of the way. The sword casts a little bit of light on the ground. <clears throat> Excuse me. But it also clips through the ground, and that's not good. It's too long. <laughs> mm. I'm taking my time with this, taking it all in. I can't tell you how excited I am. The murals down here, their images support so much of what historians have written about. Well, the environment does react to... Uh, the torchlight passing by, but... Uh, it's not really casting shadows, I guess. It's all, uh, how should I say? Normal maps? Bump mapping? I find myself wondering how did this area come to be so forgotten? Why was our history left to end here? Did the royal family in those ancient times want this place and these murals to remain secret and out of sight? I can imagine this early section of the game being a bit nightmarish for speedrunners because this is probably not something that you can skip. <laughs> that reddish fog is, in is intensifying, doesn't it? I can't shake the feeling that I'm missing something here. Why would anyone want to keep this whole area a secret? I can't be because of that. what's shown in, the, in those murals. As usual, your curiosity is gonna cause great calamity. I can only hope we'll find more answers farther below. What is it? Malice? That red thing. <clears throat> oh yeah, that totally looks like some place we want to go. 
with that gloomy mist of doom coming out of that crack. <laughs> what is this place? Let's continue, Link, but we must be extremely careful. Okay. Hmm. It's a pre-recorded video here. Not real-time graphics. And it shows. More compressed. My own stream might be, I realize, but... There's not much I can do there. I'm limited by the, the bandwidth that Twitch allows me to have. 6 megabits per second maximum. Doesn't look good. Whoa. Metroid, Metroid style. Oh. Link. Was that the sword that seals the darkness? The blade that shatters so easily against my power. Cannot save you from me. Zelda. You. Who carries that fragile sword? A link. Raru placed his faith in you. And that was all you could do. How do you know our names? I wish I wish I knew better the chronology of all the different Zeldas because he mentioned Rauru. Does that mean this is after occurring of time then? What the flipping heck? What happened to her? Uh oh. Loading and maybe saving at the same time as well. Okay, let's see. Mm. I think this could be real time graphics this time, not a video. Link, Link, wake up, Link. <gasps> Where am I? <gasps> it 
should trim your nails, my friend. Think. Finally, you wake. I've heard a great deal about you from Zelda. Your wounds were severe. I am relieved to see you escape death. Your arm, however, was beyond saving. I had to replace it, lest the injury endanger you further. Well, that's the Master Sword, but isn't it broken? It's what's left of it. <laughs> yeah. Figures. Gonna have to restore it. Decayed Master Sword. The sword that seals the darkness. Its sacred power has been diminished after being ravaged by the gloom beneath Hyrule Castle. It might still cut just enough to get through <laughs> these roots. Attack. Excuse me. Just finished eating. Attack with your equipped weapon. Y button. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, this is a jump. How do you run again, isn't it? Holding B? Ah, yeah. There we go. Mm, what's this? I just wonder what Ganon's up to. <laughs> Hi, Jack. How's it going? What are guns up to? I'm so hungry, I could hear an Octorok. Okay, now this thing uh, started spinning. What, do I have to ride these? Can I climb? Like I could... In the, I don't know, maybe you can't do that. Alright, game just released, right? Yeah, it came out today. I was actually a bit surprised that it arrived today because Amazon was telling me that it was not supposed to, but was woken up by the postman this morning uh, with uh, several orders, including this one, which I did not expect, so... Uh, <laughs> That was a pleasant surprise. Mm. Ah, yes, you can climb. It depends which surface it is, then, I suppose. Uh huh. Jump. Nothing behind me. Jump again. Whoa. Fearless Link. Interface-wise, it looks pretty similar to the previous game. Yeah, it's uh, ex expanded upon. It, it, it expands upon the previous one, I'd say. Yeah, by the looks of it. Archaic legwear. Simple, classic legwear. They're well worn and showing their age, but they've still got a few good years left in them. <laughs> Can be a bit cumbersome to have to tie the straps. Okay. Yeah, it looks like it would be cumbersome indeed. Yay! I'm not naked anymore. Alright then. Mm. Oh! The light! Go towards the light, Link. Ah, oh, birdies. Ah, so I'm in the sky then. Am I not? Aha. Okay. Jump! Yeah, sure! <laughs> ah, there's water beneath. Okay. 
Okay. I don't have control over where I'm going. Yeah, well. Naked players are the best. Yeah. Dark Souls style. Well, that's the introduction dealt with. Accelerate. Hold R. I should stop on those uh, lily pads, I think. Otherwise, I won't reach the edge. Alright. Uh, they sink a little bit. Not too much. Mm hmm. Dash. Alright, there we go. Oh, wait, what was that? I thought I saw a little text box pop up. Oh. And then you die due to falling. Yeah. <laughs> Fall damage. <laughs> Tree branch, yeah, here we go again. Wooden branches such as this are pretty common, but it's surprisingly well balanced. It doesn't do much damage, but it can serve as a weapon in a pinch. Uh huh. Do they break still? I mean, if you landed belly first, it should have done at least some damage. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> From such a height. They don't seem to break anymore. I don't think. Uh, then again, well, they have these little sparkles on them. That's perhaps to tell you that they're brand new. Maybe they do break after a while. Uh, is there... Ah, uh, that's still a thing? What's that I heard? Ah, uh, over there? Ah! Uh-oh! Sky Shroom. A common mushroom that grows near trees on Sky Islands. Heated to restore health. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, okay. Zonite Charge, a material used as a power source for constructs and other devices. Its strange light seems to reveal potent energy inside. And what's this? Soldier Construct Horn, a blade-like horn from a soldier construct. It's very sharp, so handle with care. Okay. Isn't there... Ah, like this. Okay. Right on the control stick. And then you change with the right stick. Apples? Yay! Uh, there we go. Let go. Alright. <clears throat> what do we have here? Ah. Uh, wooden stick. A tree branch with an added grip and excellent balance. Equip it and use it as a weapon. Okay. Mm. Not a tree branch. You never know. Your tree branch is badly damaged. Mm. 
Where to go? Where to go? Wonder if I can cook sky shrooms with uh, with apples. Do a little mix. Uh, is there is there anything over there? Doesn't look like it, right? Hmm. I see snow over there. The whole game isn't gonna take place in the sky, right? Oh, a dragon! If your stamina wheel runs out, you'll be too tired to do certain actions until it fills up again. Yeah, figures. Climb down. Uh, to go where? <laughs> that doesn't seem like a good idea. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Mm, climb up there, maybe? Hello, Morgan. Hi, playing the new Zelda. Yeah, indeed. I might play this and uh, Assassin's Creed on and off, I guess, uh, these days. I don't like to have more than one game going at the same time, but... But Zelda, well, I, I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait to play it. How's it so far? Uh, I only just got started, so I don't really have an opinion formed yet. But it seems just as good as the previous one, I suppose. That stamina doesn't last long, yeah. Alright, let's check up here. See what we got. Hmm. Water. I got no shield. Ah, shrooms. Well, wasn't there something in the first one where if you ran doing this, you could you could run without using without uh, depleting your stamina or something? No, I, or, or maybe it doesn't work anymore. Maybe that's fixed. Ah, well, the bird went away. Figured I might get me some, get me some ma some meat. Hmm. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do at the moment. I actually never played the first one either. Well, I played the very start. Mm -hmm. I guess it can be an acquired taste. Uh, the style of game that they went for for... Uh, well, for Breath of the Wild, I should say. Hey, what's that over there? Ah, but no, this is w no, this is where I landed when I when I came down from the sky. Okay, well, I'm I still am in the sky, I guess technically, but. Mm. Should I keep going down? If I fall from here, I will probably die. <laughs> Yeah, I may have to look for a place with water. Ah, over there, maybe. I see that there is water below, so maybe that this is where I have to go down. wonder if this game will also let you go right to the end boss if you want. I wouldn't be surprised if, they, if, if, it, if it does, because that was quite a popular feature of the previous one. Yeah, I think if I die from over there... Hey, wait. What's that? Examine. Friend or foe? Which is it? 
Link, I have waited for you. Steward construct. Uh huh. Princess Zelda left something for you in my care. When? <laughs> this is the Pura Pad. I am told it is an invaluable tool that will provide you with direction. Yay! PDA. <laughs> the Pura Pad. Princess Zelda's prized device. It has a variety of features that are essential for adventure. Uh huh. You can open it with minus. I received it from Princess Zelda. I have now passed it on to you. My rec records indicate that Princess Zelda is waiting at the location marked on its map. My message has been delivered. Where am I? We stand in the Garden of Time. The Temple of Time is visible from here. That's the Temple of Time? It was used in the distant past. Many rites and ceremonies of the kingdom were held there. But no more, and now it is a lonely place no one visits. Find Princess Zelda. New objective. Mm -hmm. Garden of Time. Church to the North is a Temple of Time. It was used in the distant past, many rites. Yeah, yeah, you already said that. Apologies, I cannot help but reminisce. Head to the indicated location, take care as to do so. Zelda needs to save herself from once. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> For a change. What was that other option I have? Uh... Ah, goodbye. <laughs> Head to the indicated location, take care as you do so. Uh -huh. I feel like that wasn't there before. I was here before and that wasn't there. Oh, maybe because I didn't have the pad, I don't know. Fancy looking bridge. Great Sky Island album. Ah, so they let you see the photos that she took before. Oh, that's interesting. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Zelda, I'm gonna, de I'm, I'm gonna delete them. <laughs> Uh, Zonai charge. Okay. Uh, oh, there's something there. Oh, an apple. I must protect myself. <laughs> They're afraid. Pick up. Throw. Your behavior is a threat. <laughs> uh, I like terrorizing these poor people. Does that make me a bully? Wooden stick. Hello, you seem to be new here. Did you intend to use that as a weapon against the soldier constructs? Soldier constructs? Oh, poor robot. <laughs> soldier constructs are those of us given strict orders to protect this land. The Zonai who created us directed them to eliminate trespassers. They will consider you a trespasser. You must treat them as a serious threat. Allow me to, to offer unsolic unsolicited advice. It is crucial to maintain a proper distance and target your opponents. Swinging aphorisedly will not yield results. Lock on. Well, yeah, okay. Yeah, t tutorial time. You may practice targeting on me if you want. Oh, but please do not actually attack. <laughs> Tread carefully around any soldier constructs you see. Our creators gave them strict orders to protect this land. Got it. They will consider you a trespasser in need of elimination. Be careful around them. Your behavior is a threat. Your behavior is a threat. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, I'll leave you alone now. <laughs> I'll leave you alone now. It was experimenting time. Alright, I guess I will have to jump from here.
Frogs! Not doing a very good job of catching them, though. Oh. Well, I guess it's no longer there. Alright. Uh-oh. Uh, need to get uh, used to these controls. Okay, well, not complicated. Ooh, it's misty. What the heck am I looking at? Uh, no, I didn't mean to do that. How do you crouch again? No, not like that. I like this. Okay. Because if I can throw my tree branch at it and it explodes on contact, that might allow me to hunt down that animal. Where is it? Is it gone? No, it's over there. Let me track down that prey. That's perfect. Careful, careful. That was not enough. <laughs> I'm gonna need another one. What is it? It looks like a weird ostrich. <laughs> ah, where did it go? Ah. What's it doing? Is it gonna calm down at some point? Run, birdie, run! No animal killing simulators! <laughs> ah! Come on! Ah! It's too quick for me! I need a bow and arrows! Wait a minute, it's over there. Maybe it's tired from all that running. Come on, Link, you can do it. Nice meat for dinner. Come on. Ah! You have to throw it further. Damn it. Ah! My meal! <laughs> Come back here. Huh. Some pepper. Spicy pepper. Come on. Barbecued birdie with spicy pepper. Mmm. <laughs> Do it, Link. <laughs> come on, come on. Yes! Excellent. <laughs> raw meat. Meat obtained from animals in plains and forests. You can eat it raw, but cooking it will make it more delicious and nutritious. Mom nom 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 nom. All right, enough enough hunting. How could you, poor birdie? Hey, there's a cooking pot right next to it. Let's cook that birdie. <laughs> Hashtag cancel Rudy. Hey. That's not what I meant to do. No! Don't do that. And then hold this. Hold this. Maybe. I think mushrooms might be a little too much. That might not be a great meal. Cook. 
Let's see what see what we got. New spicy simmered fruit, cold resistance 330. Oh, that's good. Grants low level cold resistance. The sweet dish is made by heaping tasty fruits into a pan and simmering until tender. Mmm. But wait, where did the meat go? <laughs> is it a part of it? I don't even see it. Where did the meat go? <laughs> it's wasted. It ruins it, stupid fat hobbit. Did you ever play any Pokemon games? Uh, yes, I did, yeah. Most of them, in fact. Yeah, that's the same thing. Grants mid-level cold resistance. Yeah, Pfft, okay. Oh, you can skip. Yeah, maybe I should keep making these since they do seem to work uh, well enough. It's gonna take a while though. Okay, let's do one more after this one and that'll be enough. I like Pokemon Sword Shield more than Scarlet Violet. I don't know if I would say that I have any preference between the two. I guess technically Scarlet Violet is supposed to be the superior one because it is sort of technically more advanced, although that's not saying much, because it's not very advanced at all. <laughs> I just uh, bought uh, last month Monster Hunter Stories 2, which is kind of like a Pokemon game if you like, and that's way more impressive looking. On pure technical terms, I mean. Not talking about the fun factor. I haven't played much of it yet, so I can't really say anything about that. Scarlet and Violet is so empty. But I don't know, I found Sword and Shield to be pretty empty already to begin with, but... Scarlet and Violet appears even more glitchy. A Monster Hunter Rise, yeah. Monster Hunter Stories isn't quite the same uh, kind of game, though. I tried getting into the Monster Hunter series before. The main games, shall we say, with the basic type of uh, gameplay, but it's not for me. I can't really get into them. Okay, so if you throw these kind of sticks, you can get one of these animals in one hit. Yeah, the classic type of trap. <laughs> so satisfying. Long stick. How dare you? Hey, they were just robots. You feel sorry for the robots? Well, I guess Zelda is over there. So that's the way I should be going. What's that over there? Ah, oh, it's a bird. A smaller one. What are they, pigeons? I don't know. But they hear me coming from far away. They seem to be a bit more intelligent. Uh, apples. Get them apples. There we go. I need to be very careful. I want to try to get some of this. What's that big bird doing over there? Spinning it on the spot. Ah, 
Ah. Good. It's another type. Raw bird drumstick. This meat is tougher than chewy, chewier than a standard steak. Tastes better cooked. Hey, Quelex, hey Rudy, hope you are well. Have fun with the new Zelda. I want to play it blind also, so I will skip the series, but please enjoy and give your verdict about it. Take care and see you around. Yeah, okie dokie, Quelex. No problem. Take care, man. Uh. Okay. Yeah, I was too far away. That would have been impossible. Alright. One more shrooms. Ah, uh, she's in there, I suppose. Ah. Uh, see stairs here. Uh, I'm gonna drown uh, unless I can get out before I run out of stamina. Oof, okay. Hey, there's another one. Is it keeping warm by the fire? <laughs> but you're a robot! Or is it gonna teach me how to cook? I quite like the look of Twilight Princess. Did you play it? Yeah, I did. In fact, I think... Well, no. I was gonna say I have played and streamed every single mainline Zelda game, but no. There are a few I have left to stream that I have not streamed yet. That reminds me, in the not-too-distant future, I could do a Link Between Worlds, actually, because that's one of the good ones that I have not streamed yet, because I could not stream 3DS games until I got my new PC. Ah, I roasted that, but, is it, but it is yours if you want. You roast them? Oh, I had not noticed before that you were unfamiliar to me. My apologies. Among my tasks is to explain anything that visitors might require knowledge of. You may have questions about this place. Please rest assured that a construct can answer them. I recall that your question was about roasting food. I roast ingredients by placing them beside the fire. I do not eat, but I am given to understand that it improves the taste. Our creator has roasted ingredients in order to enhance their nutritional value. Do you have ingredients? I invite you to use this fire to roast them. Well, I just used a cooking pot up, up there, so I don't really have to do that. Uh, Twilight Princess? Twilight Princess? No, that's not on Switch, no. I streamed the Wii U version of it. The HG Remaster. Which is quite sweet to play because you have uh, motion controls for aiming and you can uh, go through your inventory on the touch screen of the controller and that's quite useful. Don't drown. Ah, this one has a shield. But that probably means I can get its shield, though, for myself. Rusty Broadsword. The once fearsome sword. This once fearsome sword has seen better days. It can do some damage in the right hands, but also breaks quickly. Old wooden shield. An aged, worn-out wooden shield. It can withstand lighter attacks such as arrows. Raise your shield. Press an old ZL. Okay.
Alrighty then. Denied, I guess. Won't be seeing Zelda anytime soon. That door will open only to those with sufficient power. I'm sorry. I did not intend to startle you. It was I that spoke to you earlier. That arm originally belonged to me. I am Raru. Raru, you've changed. <laughs> You look like a goat now. <laughs> a bit. <laughs> Forgive me for appearing to you in this manner. Unfortunately, I no longer have a physical form. In any case, that arm should allow you to open this door. It seems to have lost the power to do so. Ah, uh, there's always something to restore the Master Sword, my arm. <laughs> But you would need to enter a place filled with sacred light. And there's no such thing anymore. Of course. Why not visit the shrines on this island? That's this game's great plateau. <laughs> the shrines. Yes, I'm sure they are the key. Store new objective. Uh huh. Okay, what? So I have to go there and then this one first. Uh, wait a second. I could do this before. Yeah. Yeah. If you can still do this, that's pretty sweet. Is there another one? Yes. All right. Uh. I don't think I see any other. Hmm. No, not up there. Not there either. Well, that's two for now. Holy shit! Uh, thank you for gifting uh, subscriptions. Uh, colleagues, much appreciated. Oof. Okay, that was a bit too high. Holy shit. And thank you, Morgan, for the sub. Do I get to this place? Ah, yeah, like this. Ah. I heard ro Robot Boy. Ah, he has a bow! He has a bow! I want that bow! Ow! Okay, yeah. Use your shield, really. Use your shield. But, but I was holding it up. Old wooden bow. Rip. Press and hold. Zadar release. Soldier construct horn. I got your stick. Alright. Wait, there's another one? 
there's another one. What's that I heard? Oh. Never mind. And more arrows. That's always nice. Let's move on. Okay, there's the thing. Ah. From down there, then. Yeah, I remember these. Rush room. A mushroom that can grow almost anywhere but prefers ceilings and sheer cliffs. Cook it before eating to temporarily increase your movement speed. Were, was that how they were called before? I don't recall. But I certainly recall them from the first game though. I I was looking at my stamina, I didn't really look at the, the name of the place. So is it gonna be all like little tiny puzzly dungeons like in the first one or uh, anything more substantial this time around? I quite like the, the look of the the place. Nice. Needs to load. Tips and tricks. Mm -hmm. It's very gray. Oh. So you've made it here. This is a shrine of light. Long ago I filled these places with light that purges evil. I believe this light will restore an ability your right arm has lost. Now then, extend your hand. <laughs> Ultra hand. Like that, that that old Nintendo toy. Grab and move objects. Rotate them and stick them to other objects. Okay. That's gonna take some getting used to. This is the Ultra Hand ability. It allows you to move objects freely and attach them to other objects. With it, you will be able to build a great number of things. Really, anything you can imagine. Mm. Use Ultra Hand and receive the blessing from the shrine. Ba, 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 ba. Activate. Cancel. There we go. Yeah, it's like, uh, what was it called in the previous one? Magnesis or something like that? Except that was only for metallic objects. But I guess uh, this time it's for more than just that. Rotate. Are you using the D-pad? Oh, that's quite useful, actually. Ouch! Okay. <laughs> My mistake. Uh, need to get used to this. It's maybe just not long enough. Didn't he say I could use it to stick it to other objects? Move forward. Cancel. Hmm. Unless... Think, really think. If I do it like this... Ah, no. I didn't it did not fall the way I wanted it to. 
Unless the other one is bigger and I'm just trying to make it work uh, in a way that's more complicated than it needs to be. Knowing me, it wouldn't be a first. Or maybe you can climb to uh, attach? Ah. Ah, uh, hold on then. Hold on. I, I need to learn how this works. Okay, I'll get the other one. I'll attach them together. Attach. <laughs> They're glued together. <laughs> okay. Ah, okay. Oh, well, okay, that's uh, interesting. Okay, well. I'm learning. This is all new to me. What the heck am I even looking at? Hooks? Uh, okay... I suppose I have to reattach this one. I even chose a little gooey bit of glue that, that, that's gonna attach the two. Well, okay, it's a bit precarious, but... Can you detach them afterwards? Unstick? Ah, okay, you can unstick them. Right, if I attach it exactly like the f like like the other one is. No! Ah! Okay, this is not easy to control. Stick to the thing above, not the plank. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna move them out of the way. Okay, yeah. I assume this is how I have to do it. Wait, this this thing is oh, okay. It's standing vertically. Okay. <laughs> is it supposed to work that way? I'm not so sure. <laughs> but that's an interesting way to do it, I guess. Uh what am I supposed to do though now? Uh, 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 do I have to use a hook on that rail? What does the other one look like? Ah, I see. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm only just starting to understand. Okay, let go of that. Boom. Cancel. All right. And then uh what well, not necessarily no. Uh, hold on. Get on it! Get on it! Get on it! Okay. 
Okay. Gee, did they really have you think hard on these things? You have done well to reach this place. We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. Light of Blessing, a crystal that glows with the light that purges ancient evil and purifies with its radiance. Okay. What, you trade you trade four for an extra heart container and that sort of thing at some point? May the Light of Blessing grant you the strength you seek. You did very well getting through that shrine, and you've restored an ability. This is wonderful. If you visit and complete two more shrines, you should be able to open the door to the Temple of Time. You may want to mark the shrines in the distance with pins. Then you'll never lose track of where they are. I, I already did. And I think I can see another one there in the distance in the background that I may not have marked yet. The Pura Path offers you a very useful scope, it's quite handy. It was right behind him. I saw it during the cutscene, and indeed, there it is. Is there another one I can see from here? Well, it looks like, like I'm gonna have to use the rail to get down there. And I guess from there, it's an easy path to the next shrine. There is one all the way at the very top, but... I'm half expecting there to be at least four. Like on the Great Plateau in the first one. That seems like the kind of thing they... May want to do. R remain consistent, you know? Yeah, I can see pieces of stuff that I can use to build a... Uh, I don't know how to say it in English. <laughs> uh, s s like ski lifts, if you kn if you know what I mean. Stuff you can ride up and down uh, ski slopes. <laughs> So when I charge, a sky shroom. Okay, where was it that rail? I saw it and now I've lost track of it. Ah, yeah, over there. I see. Uh, I can't cross though, uh, unless over there. Ooh, ooh. The cur the current is too strong. <laughs> okay. Julie noted. Don't go in the water. Or at least not on that side. What is that? What is it? Is it the Temple of Time... Chiming? What is it? I thought it was when I... 
passed by here that I could hear it. Uh, and now I can't hear it anymore. Doesn't make any sense. Mm, uh, Alright. Let's put these powers to good use. From the other side, Rudy. This is so awesome, I like it. <laughs> this is typically the kind of game that's still gonna be played years from now and people will still discover new ways to abuse the physics and, and all that. Just like the original, hopefully. <laughs> hmm. What's that one here? I'll have to put, put that on the water somewhere, I suppose. Looks like a raft. Oh. Oh, and it's blowing in the wind. Huh. Interesting. I see that they're still at work even now. We originally created the constructs to assist in our endeavors. All of us were found on them. I never imagined they would continue to carry out their assigned tasks to this day. Mm. The fact that their labor no longer serves any purpose, yet they perform it still. It's, it, it is disquieting to me. What a waste of energy. <laughs> Wood. A portable bundle of wood. You can use this to make a campfire if you have something to light it. Uh-huh. Rudy, why are you doing this? Isn't it simpler to just rise it well above the ground and then let it go? Makes more sense, doesn't it? What's this, an axe? Ah, I can't carry any more. Ah. Oh. Um. Your one stick broke. Stone axe. Now I wonder if maybe, just maybe. Okay, it's true what they say. The performance of the game really dips when you're using uh, these powers in combination. Can I make a really big raft? I wonder. Mm-hmm. How does that look? Let's make it bigger still. It's already offering me these bits of wood, so... Uh, Alright. That better be good glue. Uh-huh. Now. Oh, 
Oh, and now I got a Korok front. Okay. Uh, tree branch. Well, don't need it, I guess. It doesn't look quite as nicely cut, but hey. I can't see very well if it's lined up well with the rest. Well, there we go. That's a nice looking raft, I think. Can't you... You can't get on it? If you jump, I guess. Okay. Okay. Doesn't look very comfortable to, to, to stand on, but... Just looking at Link's feet... Yikes! <laughs> I wouldn't want to have my feet bent that way. Okay, well... Hello, you. Fix your gaze forward. Face it head on. Hmm? Pardon me. I was absorbed in my woodcutting. Are you here for woodcutting too? Wood cutting. It is the practice of sh chopping down trees to create logs. Logs can be combined to assemble platforms. You can also chop them down further to make wood. Lumber ma has many uses. This is why I come here daily to chop wood. Until there's none left! <laughs> and yet I still find it difficult to chop them down in the, in the intended direction. This is why you may have heard me muttering to myself, fix your gaze forward, face it head on. Ah, I apologize. I have been rambling for some time. There is an axe I no longer need over there. It is yours to use if you want to do some woodcutting. Yeah, but I was not supposed to make a little raft with it. Ah, oh, well. That doesn't that doesn't mean I can't use it as a bridge, though. Okay. I want to put it on the water. What else would you use it for? That has to be it, right? Oh, look at it. Look at it. Looks perfect. Select bow. Uh -huh. Shh, quiet. I am engaged in hunting. Yes, I hunt wild creatures that inhabit the forest. Why? You don't even eat them. Hmm? I do not remember seeing you here before. We constructs fulfill several roles. One is to provide any necessary explanations to newcomers such as yourself. Other constructs you, will, you meet will be able to answer questions you may have about other, su other subjects. My specialty is hunting. To hunt is to dispatch wild creatures. Many of them dwell within this forest. They are highly nutritious to organic life. They are also ext extremely wary. A hunter must not make noise. Crouching is essential for silence. Yeah, I know. A bow can be used to strike from afar. Aiming for weak spots is best. I will give you the bow placed over there. Use it as you please. <whistles> ah! Silly! How do you... How do you switch your bow again? Oh, by the way. You don't have to take pictures of the animals in this one. To register them or something. No. That's not what I meant to do. Ah, yikes. Can't I remove them? Delete. Delete. How do you... She could take photos before. I don't know how to do it myself. How do you select the bow? Ah, like this. Okay. <laughs> so much for that.
Master Sword is running low on energy. What, he uses energy? thing here what is that do I need to place it somewhere <laughs> yeah of course you can't write it when you're on it Okay, where was that shrine now? Uh, there was one on the same island, I think, no? Uh, which one is it? Uko Shrine. Oh, so this is where I am. I went down that way. I saw it from afar before, but now I can't see it. Where is it? I'll be confused. Or is it that you can raise these platforms? Hmm. Oh, wait a second. What's down that way? Oh, shrooms. Got your breath, Link. Okay, it's got a ladle in its hand. My next batch will also be tasty. Pardon me for not noticing you, I was absorbed in preparing my next meal. Mm? I do not recall having seen you before today. I must doubt, doubly apologize for my inattentiveness. It is the duty of a construct to field any, quest any questions that those such as yourself may have. You may pose these questions to any construct. We will answer them as best we can. Are you interested in my cooking? Cooking? Question mark. Ah, you seem to be uneducated when it comes to cooking. Well, I never. Very well, you will learn how to create a meal on your own. Educate me! Cooking step one. Hold the ingredients in your arms. Step two, throw them into a pot over a lit fire. Cooking complete. Oh. That is the simple version. The world of cooking can be as complex as you want. There are many possible dishes. What you make and what effect you gain depends on the ingredients used. Some meals are warming. Others may replenish stamina. Tiny organisms known as critters and monsters. Monster parts are not food. Save them as the base for elixirs. This information was provided by our creators, but I cannot eat, so take it with a grain of salt. Food joke. That was bad. <laughs> I will remain stationed here. Ask me anything you have further question. Ask me any time you have further que questions about cooking. Yeah, I can't read. Culinary construct, it says. <laughs> Doesn't work. Okay, good. You never know when you might need these. Oh, a flower I have not seen before. Stem bulb, a wild plant with bulging roots. It looks like a leek. With bulging roots often found in cooler climates, it contains nutrients that increase endur endurance. Cook it to restore stamina. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm not gonna hunt down every single one I see. Hmm. 
Ah, uh, there it is. Okay. Found it. Uh huh. Hmm. Okay, they don't give you uh, a simple looking flank this time around. I need to reach my friend. Oh, a Kurok. I'm gonna have to make my you to make my own platform, I guess. Talk to it. This is awful. Where's my friend? Huh? You can see me? I'm a Korok, one of the children of the forest. You can keep your 1,000 little pieces of poop this time around. <laughs> I was traveling with my friend, but we got separated. My friend is sending up a smoke signal. I can't wait to catch up. Yeah. I'm so tired, though. I can't move. I'm probably going to have to take it with me. Nine hundred and ninety-nine little pieces of poop. <laughs> Come on. Ah. Horizontal rotation? No. Vertical rotation? Why can't I... Ah, like this. Okay. Okay. Good. That should do it. Oof! <laughs> Attach. <laughs> it's glued to it. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oof, 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 oof. <laughs> no? I need to reach my friend. Yeah, you and me both. It's not working? Okay, stay on it. Okay, unstick. There we go. There's my friend. You're here. <laughs> what? But that's it, right? It's in the right spot, isn't it? Reunited at last. Thanks. I'd like to give you something, but here's all I have. Did you keep those little pieces of poop? The small seed was given you by a, to you by a Korok. It has a distinct smell. If you gather a bunch of them, you never know what may happen. Yeah. You get the giant golden turn in the end. <laughs> Bye. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I charge. All right. Well, I can reuse the same platform for the next one. Ooh, fireflies. Don't go away. Ah, I should have pressed the A button instead. Mm hmm. Bye bye. Okay, I'll reuse the same platform. Save me some time. Ok, 
Okay, get going. Very slowly. <laughs> I should have taken the sail with me. Oh, but the game probably has another one here, I guess. Well, they give you plenty of trees to cut down. Oh, you can't do that. Thick stick. A thick bat cut from a large tree. It's not the sturdiest weapon, but it's heavy and does have a bit of power behind it. Okay, let's see. Stone axe. You never know. Might need it. Uh, don't use this one yet, I guess. Uh, get rid of those that are... Uh, kind of not good first. <laughs> Keep the good stuff for when you have to face stronger enemies. Hmm. Ah, but there's a sail. Mm-hmm. If I use... If I replace the... The hook on my raft for a sail. Excuse me. Okay, the wind is blowing that way. So if I want to reach the other end, I should probably start from here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we're going. Seems to be working. There we go, without breaking a sweat. Choo choo jelly, a gelatinous substance that came from a choo choo. It's unusual in this state, but applying it a bit of an elemental stimulation will change its form, yeah. Electricity, cold, these sorts of things. This one wouldn't stick. There we go. And there's another shrine. <clears throat> Inisa shrine. Okay, well, I guess we can skip the animation. I'll get me something to drink. I'll be right back.
Okay, so you've made it here, and now then extend your right hand. Uh, another new power. What's that? A sword icon. Fuse, attach something to an equipped weapon or shield to enhance it. You can undo the fusion, but that will destroy whatever has been attached. Okay. Mm. Okay. <clears throat> It allows you to fuse something nearby to your weapon or shield, thereby enhancing it. Why not pick up that sword just ahead and then fuse a nearby object to it? Mm. Use fuse and receive the blessing from the shrine. Mm -hmm. Set ability. You can quickly set an ability. Press and hold, etc., etc. The ability to combine. Rusty Claymore, but you can't carry any more. I can attach a wooden stick to it. Uh, okay. <laughs> what? Uh, that's still not helping. Uh... Excuse me. Uh, mm -hmm. Ah, never mind. Oops. Rusty Claymore stick. Uh... Uh, or do I have to use this? No. Hmm. Or wait a second. Uh, I think I may just have sacrificed my shield. It's kind of hard to understand. Rotate, sword, select. Destroy fuse material. Ah, okay, never mind. Ah, but I lost the claymore that way. Oh yeah, now it's gone. But it didn't have to be the Claymore, I guess. Right? Uh... <laughs> ah... see plants over there. Ah, this one has a chest on it. Mm -hmm. Is there another one? No. Satisfying.
Okay, but that's very uh, stam uh, stamina consuming, I guess. Fire fruit. I think I can I can see what's coming up. Attach material to arrows. Attach materials from your inventory to your arrows. to a door inside a shrine of light. Mm -hmm. Tells me I'm gonna have to do the same. Whoa. Is there a clever way to do it? Now they're gone? Well, I'll try to fight it with what I have. Whoa. I might die. I'm dead. How do you dodge again? I think you can roll out of the way or jump backwards or something like that. Oh uh, yeah, I have to do, do it again from here. RIP! The ability to combine in Isa Shrine. Yeah, the claymore that was there before, it's gone. Uh, the chest up there, I already got it. The chest up there, I already got what was inside. I already opened the gate. I didn't lose any progress, it just sent me back to the entrance. That's good. Maybe a longer stick. Have a, a bigger reach that might be better. I'm gonna sacrifice that stick. Your boulder hammer broke. <laughs> ah, wait a second. Set it on fire, know what I mean? Ah! Construct bow. A bow used by a captain construct. Though simply built, it is made of fireproof materials and won't catch fire as wooden bows do. Hmm. 
Captain Construct Horn. Captain Construct One, I guess. Horn. Something like that. Well, anyway. Mm, there was another one here. Yeah, they give you plenty of stuff to work with, I guess. Well, that's it. They didn't hide any chests behind the, the, the thing at the end, right? I'm half expecting it to be the case at some point. Got a reward. People who are curious enough to check, you have done well to reach this place. We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Light of Blessing, that's two. <clears throat> okay. That's two shrines down. Instead of throwing yourself at enemies over and over to no avail, try cooking special dishes and elixirs to give yourself better defense, etc, etc, etc. Link. I came because there is something I failed to give you. Please take it. The heck? Energy cell, a gift from a Zonai construct designed to be worn on a belt. It can power Zonai devices. What I have just given you is an energy cell. It is required to make use of the tools known as Zonai devices. I cannot demonstrate its utility because there are no Zonai devices right here. However, I have associates on the other side of that cave system. They can teach you how to use this. I hope that the energy cell I provided is useful to you. Can I see another shrine from here that I have not done yet? And which I have not marked on the map. Uh, there are clouds I can't see. Hmm. Well, that doesn't look like one. Hmm. What's that thing? Ah. Uh. Okay. Uh, well, there's a shrine up there, but I've already got it marked. A little ruin there. I'm not sure, actually. Maybe from... I've already done this one. I can see that it's already open. That was the previous one. Okay, well, uh, let's keep going. Any other information for me? It is required to make use of the tools, blah, blah, blah. Okay, he's just gonna rep gonna repeat the same thing over and over. Mm. I can see robots down there. You have associates. <sighs> they can teach you how to use this. Take care.
Okay. Let them fight amongst themselves then, I guess. And I'll finish off the victor. Uh. There we go. Two arrows is all it took. Green room. Cave. Another shield, what's this? Board Guster? Guster. Huh. Okay, what about that thing over there? Can I grab it? Wouldn't that be easier? Can't I simply jump? Cross that gap. I may not have to, but I'll try anyway. Soldier Reaper. I can't carry anymore. So throw one away then. Uh, this one. Drop. That thing here, I wonder. Hmm. Yeah, boy, I wonder what that do what that does. To blow things off, I guess. Yeah, exactly. Could I have blown the the, the chest off? It's quite the heavy weapon, though, this one. What's this one? Here. Thick stick. Well, that's the same. Discovery! Pondside Cave. Bright bloom seed. A seed that's found in caves or wells. When struck, it will take root and bloom, giving off faint light from a small flower. Keys eyeball. Keys wink. Flint. Bubble gem, strange crystal, by left by defeated bu bubble frog. Bubble frog in caves. Its eerie blue glow may entice you to collect even more. Yeah, I forgot you could do that actually. Rock salt. Giant bright bloom seed. Seed that's found on the ground. 
When struck, it will take root and bloom, radiating a large amount of light from a big flower. Gonna have to use that in dark places, I take it. Ember, a fossilized resin with a caramelesque sheen to it. It's been valued as a component in decorations and crafting since ancient times. Ruby, a precious red ore mined from large ore deposits. Rubies contain the power of fire and have fetched a high price since ancient times. More ember. Bright bloom seeds. <laughs> Archaic tunic. Hmm. Old fashioned upper body wear. It's got it's got some holes, but the soft cloth feels good to the touch. It's hard to keep it wrinkle free. Must be a nightmare. Alright. Uh, there we go. He's got that titular look now. Uh, Rauru is here. Uh, mm -mm. The rafts for crossing to the other side are broken. Transportation is on hold indefinitely. This is ordinarily where we send resources across the river. The only silver lining is that the Zonai devices are undamaged. Zonai devices? Ah, it seems you do not know of Zonai devices. There are necess necessities around here. Allow me to explain. This green thing is called a Zonai device. The one you see here is a fan. You can produce wind on demand by striking it. They are self-evidently useful. We have a variety of Zonai devices for multitudinous purposes. Using Zonai devices does require energy. An external energy cell will be necessary in your case. Ah, you have one already. That is a relief. But perhaps a refresher is necessary. An energy, energy cell stores at the energy required to use Zonai devices. Its energy will replenish automatically while Zonai devices are not in use. Its capacity is not unlimited. Use the energy contained within wisely. Otherwise, you may run out of inopportune moments. At inopportune moments. Excuse me. Pardon the long explanation. It does not change our need for a raft. Zonai devices are extremely useful. Think creatively and you will find many ways to employ them. For glitching and speedrunning. Probably. The rats are broken. The Zonai devices will be useless until they are fixed. Yeah, I don't need another explanation on what Zonai devices are. They're seriously damaged. They may be beyond repair. This could pre present a problem. Look at Rauru just sitting there chilling. Mm. The steward constructs were the first to be built. After that, we crafted others to suit it to different roles. Culinary constructs. Maker constructs. You'll find all sorts of them still active in this place. Some became so skilled within their specialties that they surpassed us. We began to learn from them instead. You should take time out to talk to them. They can teach you many things you might not yet know. What? We may have need of these parts. There are more materials near the water available for your use. Ah, you guys are no fun. Well, aren't three just enough? We may have need of these parts. There are more materials near the water available for your use. Yeah, okay, fine. Doesn't change the fact that I need a, a sail.
Mm. Do I have a sail somewhere? What is that sound? Is it chiming the, t the time it is? I think it might. Mm. Will I find a sail over that way? Ah! Silly! Up there I have to go, or... Well, I guess there's a little island there on the other side. What I can't? Ah, uh, well. Well, because at that height, I'm, t I'm too far away from it. I don't understand. Oh yeah, because I can't bring it further up. Okay. Fireflies. Sunset Firefly. Hmm, well, one of them flew away, but... Is there anything up here? Those stairs over there. Uh, ah, but yeah, no, that this is where the cave was. Okay, no, fair enough. The cave is literally under my feet. As a dodo. Mm. Well, okay, let's try to carefully get back down then. to get to that chest. Alright. A 
more ember. Oh, didn't see that thing was there. Did it fall off? Oh, I think it did. <laughs> Well, I have to get back now. I don't want to attach it. But I didn't mean to, anyway. Mm -hmm. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. No more stamina. Hold on. Okay. Uh, well, I still haven't found the sail. How do I make one? Oh, they're asleep. Okay. Or would it be possible to... I wonder if I tried to take them while they're asleep. Now nah, they wake up. <laughs> Ah, we may have needed these parts. Yeah, yeah, okay, fine, I get it. It's very difficult to rest... What? What did it say? It's very difficult to rest peacefully. What? It's very difficult to rest peacefully when things like this happen. <laughs> okay. Well, excuse me. Mm. How do I make a sail? I don't have one. Ah, oh, there's fish. Ancient arowana. Okay. Because I guess if you blow wind... It's not gonna be much use to, to a raft if there's no sail to receive the wind. For propulsion, no? How do I power it up? Oh no. It's floating away. How do I power it up? Mm. How do I power it up? I don't understand. I could use the platforms that are over that way, bring them here and cross that way, but this is clearly not the intended way. I'd like to understand how I'm supposed to do it under other circumstances. Although, I guess, hold on. Maybe I can do it that way. I 
I don't think that's working. Where am I gonna get that sail? Uh, I just came out of that cave. Unless I don't need any. You use a tree trunk vertically uh, adjusted to make a sail out of it. Ah, I'm stuck. What's happening? No idea if this could work. Of course not. It's not a sail. <sighs> uh. I guess te technically on a purely physical level it should work, but... Or do I have to cut down one of those trees and that will magically create a sail? I have no idea. Because I do need to cross to the other side, don't I? Or I guess I can create a long, long, long bridge all along the side here. Or I guess I can let it go. That's one way to do it, I guess, but it's not super optimal. It's very far from optimal. <laughs> and that weapon on my back is really annoying at the moment. Okay. Well, I'll get more. <laughs> this is clearly not how you're supposed to do it, but... Wait a minute! Did I lose one? Or I guess you could push them... Using the first one, no? Wouldn't that work? <laughs> this is so silly. <laughs> It gets super delayed when you've got so many parts attached to one another. Maybe there's a hard limit actually to how many you can uh, attach to one another. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of tree trunks though. And the way there's one here that's already cut. I must protect myself. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I'm gonna drown. I can't see. I can't see. Oops. 
Ah! I'm stuck. I'm going to drown. Oh yeah, I'm stuck. Nothing I can do. I'm dead. Okay, yeah, th this is clearly not the intended way, so I shouldn't be surprised. No, not that. Food. Food! Where are the meals I cooked? None. Okay, uh... I'm so close already, I don't think I need that much more. I could try actually to to swim. Mm, no, I think that's probably still too far. I get stuck. I get stuck. Is there anything I can eat maybe to restore stamina? <sighs> Wasn't it? Cook it to release its stamina restoration properties. Okay. That's not gonna work like that then. <laughs> Wasn't there a cooking pot nearby? Nah, no, there's none. Hmm. All right, then. We'll try, right? Ah, no, ah! Oh, it's not rotating anymore. Well, that's good. I might be in luck then. Yeah, that's still some distance, though. Alright, then. Let's glue more together. I can understand why some people might not like the crafting system of this game, but I like it, personally. I like the creativity it, uh, it allows you to have. And I can see why they did it that way, they figured... That's one of the things that people seemed to have enjoyed doing the most in the first one. Finding creative way to solve problems. That may not be the essence of Zelda per se, so... Yeah, maybe this is not like a classic Zelda game, but... I can still appreciate what it does. Kinda wish they didn't do exclusively these types of Zelda games anymore though. Like, they could do with a bit more variety. Okay, I 
then there was another one. And if I need more, I still have two, to, two that I can cut down. Ah, uh, no! Uh, I managed to get stuck again. Uh, yeah, I'm stuck. Oh, uh, well. Dash and... Dash and die, I guess. Oh, blah, 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 blah. As long as it doesn't despawn the those that I... Work to 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 bring all that all the way over there. Um, not that. Swords drop back. I don't want to drop it. I want to eat it. Well, we're almost there, right? That's how you make a bridge. <laughs> it looks so silly. This is so not the intended way. Alright, well. And I'm still going to drown, I think. I think I'm going to need all of the tree trunks. <laughs> if I even want to stand a chance. I was almost there, though. There's really not much missing. Alright, then. Let's continue to deforest this place. Not sure if I have to collect these. Okay. been stuck on this problem for way too long. Let's <laughs> go. 
Well, we're almost there, aren't we? And I got no more trees <laughs> to work with. So, it's better work this time. Come on. Come on. Oof. Okay. I made it at last. Should talk to this one. Hello. I don't have a raft. Oh, are you going this direction? This is very late to be traveling. This mountain path is especially rugged. You must take your environment into account when traveling. I have developed guidelines for traveling this mountain path. Shall I tell you them? Yeah, let's hear them, I guess. Fire is a crucial tool when traversing the mountain path. A fire can be used either to cook or to warm yourself. I can cook? You can cook anytime and anywhere. All you need is a pot with a lit fire. One method of cooking is simply to throw random ingredients into the pot. Others are more careful. This is the best way to make meals that can warm you up. Other effects are also possible. Insects and monster parts are not edible. Do not cook horns or guts with food. Save these parts as materials for elixirs. Elixirs are also helpful in the mountain. They are an alternate way to warm your body or recover stamina. I think I can figure out the rest. It must not be so different from uh, previous Zelda games, I imagine. Flint. And then I have this method, I guess. Okay. Ah, but no. Ah. Okay, let's see. Robber drumstick and mushrooms. Mushrooms. This. No, ah. Uh. A bit of pepper. Drumstick. And salt. How about that, huh? Looks good to me. Spicy salt grilled meat. Restore seven hearts. Grants low level cold resistance. Short on ingredients? Just rub some meat in the salt and cook it for a simple tasty dish. Mmm. Mmm. Now you're speaking my language. <laughs> oh, wait a second. Huh. Whoa. Okay. Yaha. Ah, yeah. uh, you're not S2. But you see me? I didn't know someone like you could see children of the forest. Well, if you see Hestu, please return this to him. Oh, and my friends are hiding in lots of different places too, so you should keep an eye out while you wander. Uh-huh. Okay. Good. Understood. I want these. Uh huh. Okay. Good. That seems to be it. Have to climb back up, I suppose. A 
found the secret. Come back here, you! Ah! Why did you do that? <laughs> it preferred committing suicide than ending in my stomach. <laughs> ah! Frustrating. Are the logs I set before still uh, where I put them? By the way. Yes, I guess they are. Huh. That's funny. <laughs> and hey, if it works, it may not be super optimal, but... Huh. Okay, there we go. Let's make a little train choo-choo. Uh, that's not what I meant. I don't want to attach them. Okay, there we go. And then... Here's what we'll do. I'll attach one at the back. Facing backwards. Yeah. How does that look? But how do I use my the, the the power to activate them? I don't know. Yeah. Uh Grab, move, rotate, no. Because I'd like to get it going, but... I can't interact with it, so... Oh, what? They, t they only teach you how to do it after you've restored a raft for them? Oh, if that's the case, that's super, that's super annoying because that means I have to cross back the other way then. <sighs> I might not even be able to. That's what's worse. Uh, what's it called? <whistles> no, not that. It's not that either. That's to use the shield, that's to use the bow. Or which, or I thought it was. But no, not this one, the other one! Ah.
Oh, okay, there was a wall. That's why the camera was misbehaving. I was aiming above the shield and I still couldn't hit it. Ah, oh, it killed me. It still got me. still appear to be on this side of the water though and now I have nothing to cross back the other way so if they do teach you how to use these I'm I'm fucked literally there's no way for me to do it uh, how do you use the what's it called the energy cell okay Let's see about that. How to use energy cell. Tears of the kingdom. I can't use it. I don't know how to. How to upgrade it. How to get it and its uses. Uh, how to get Uh, okay, yeah, it's just a, a placeholder article. Yeah, th I, I hate this sort of thing because there are the top results in, in Google, but uh, the game is so recent that there's, there's nothing, really. How to use. Grants an advantage in one aspect of the game and generally improves the quality of life for easier exploration, combats, and other features. Check back soon for more updates on a specific way to use the energy cell. Yeah, well. <sighs> After completing the in Isu shrine, a steward construct will give you the Zonai energy cell. Use Zonai charges in the inventory to refill the energy cell. Do I need to use one? Hold. What's that? Ah, uh, no, that's not it. Ah! Then hit a Zonai device once in most cases. What? I just have to hit it? That's it? That's all? Uh... They may have explained it before, but I just wasn't paying attention. I was off in my own little world. Yeah, but I guess it's not gonna work much longer, though. I would do well to be in it before I attach it, though.
Ah. Oh, I can't ride it any further. That's a shame. Aww. That's a shame. <laughs> this cave is especially dark. You will need a light in order to proceed to the mining site ahead. Do you have any bright bloom seeds? I can glue one to one of my swords or something like that. Maybe to make a torch, no? Yeah, I know of them actually, but it explained to me anyway. Yeah, bright blooms. They shine very brightly. Many use them as illumination in dark places. They grow natively in caves such as this one. This cave has been picked, picked mostly clean of them. That is because it is especially dark. The seeds were often necessary. I am posted here to provide a reminder to bring bright bloom seeds. By the way, did you know that bright blooms require a stimulus to blossom? Striking a bright bloom seed or attaching it to an arrow will cause it to activate on impact. The bright bloom you see growing there is no different. I caused it to blossom. It will generally be in your best interest to use bright bloom seeds in dark places such as 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 such as
Are they melting it? Oh, what's this? Ah, I have not given permission to take those. Could it be that you have forgotten to bring Zonai capsules? I don't know what they are. I have for if you have forgotten yours, or perhaps you may not even know what I mean. Zonai capsules are a convenient means of carrying portable Zonai devices. It is unfortunate that you seem to have none. I will lend you a few spares. Fans. Okay. The ones I gave you were fan types. You can deploy them at any time. They will generate wind when struck. Zonai devices are useful and come in many varieties. I always carry several with me for any occasion. Many neglect to keep a healthy supply on hand. I keep watch for such individuals. The spares I give you were the, gr the last ones I carried. Take care not to forget again. Yo. Oh, my legs hurt. My poor legs. I remember that a device cannot be put back. Remember that a device cannot be put back in its capsule. Think carefully before deploying one from your poot pouch. Pouch. I was gonna say pooch. That. Sorry, man. I didn't want to scare you. This cave previously had ample resources. It is gradually yielding less and less. That is why I require support, but my requests have so far gone unanswered. I must therefore continue to mine without resting. What's it gonna do now? It's moving away. It stopped trying to break it now that it's gone, at least. It's not stupid. Now I have 40. Hey! Excuse me. <laughs> that Zonai is already slayed for processing. It would pose difficulties for me if you took it for yourself. Oh, are you unfamiliar, unfamiliar with it? This is the Zonai I mentioned. It is a unique mineral that can be mined far beneath the land below. There are traces deposits of it on this island as well, but they are limited to this cave. Our society flourished by processing this substance into other materials. Zonayid is processed by smelting it in a furnace. It is thereby converted into materials with useful properties. A few such materials will be ready for your review shortly. Wait one moment. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, I slept like 12 hours. No, maybe not 12 hours. No, I went to sleep at 7.30 in the morning. And then I got, I got up a little bit before 5 p.m. So, yeah, 9 hours and 30 minutes. But I really needed it. Might not be able to go to sleep too early today, though. Thank you for your patience. I will now explain what sorts of materials the ore can be processed into. Processed into. Zonai technology is typically powered by Zonai charges. These occasionally solidify into a form known as crystallized charges. Converting Zonayid into p other powerful materials in this way is called processing. Yeah, yeah, but I already knew what these were. Yeah, uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Crystallized charges. So they restore more. Okay. And what? Do I... Do I just throw them in there? Ah, no, okay, yeah, you choose what you want to, to get from this menu, I guess. He's selling exactly just how many you can get up to this point. Yeah, that can't be a coincidence. Why did he say the robot? Did you say something? Leaving this area is easy. Simply use the Zonai capsules I gave you earlier. Yeah, okay. Goodbye. I understand. Or, or at least uh, I un I understand the theory. In practice, I'm I still have to learn how to do it. Uh... 
Here we go! Let's hope I have enough energy. It's funny how Link does not rotate with the minecart. If he's facing forward and the minecart turns, he will still be facing the same direction. <laughs> yeah. Save that energy. I say. The time bell that sounds from the Temple of Time rings at a set time each morning and evening. Along with the constructs, we woke to the sound of the bell. When we heard it in the evening, we knew it was time to rest. Mm -hmm. It also played its part in our traditional ceremonies, in the way it was this place's beating heart. The sight of the temple and the sound of its bell stir found memories in me. I need to reach my friend. Where is he? Oh, my friend and I got separated. My friend is sending up a smoke signal. I can't wait to catch up. I'm so tired though. I can't move. I need to reach my friend. Well, I guess I can also make a bridge. I don't necessarily have to use a minecart. Or maybe I do, actually. <laughs> what are the planks for, then? Y you may not have to use them, I suppose. I wonder if he can maybe glue them together to make a bridge to reach that little ledge up there. Maybe. I'll try. I want I want to experiment. There's this thing right in front of me. Okay. Is that all of them? Not quite. Crap, I've got it stuck underneath. Ah. It adjusts ever so slightly the position of the last one. So that will so that it will line up perfectly with the last one, I guess. Okay. Well, I think that's a reasonably sized bridge. Isn't it? Ah, <laughs> uh, wait a second. 
<laughs> I think it's pretty funny. Even then, I'm not sure that it will be long enough, but... I can't see. The camera won't let me see. You know, <laughs> I guess it could work, and it does. <laughs> okay, wonderful. That looks very silly. It's not very cool looking, but <laughs> is it really stupid if it works? I'm not sure. Portable pot. A Zonai device for cooking food almost anytime, anywhere. Okay, it lasts for cooking one recipe only. The device is easier to use on flat surfaces. Yeah, I imagine it would be. <sighs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, it's stuck v v pretty good, so, uh, that's an encouraging sign. Okay, maybe I can use the minecart I came with, so I don't have to... Well, there was another fan anyway, if need be, but... What's that thing here, by the way? It's a dispenser? <laughs> It looks like a gacha capsule dispenser. <laughs> Device dispenser operation confirmed. On track to meet today's Zonai capsule production target. Oh, do you want to use a device dispenser? I have nearly met my target. You are welcome to use it. A device dispenser? This is a device dispenser. It produces Zonai capsules by, by converting certain resources. The resources it accepts are things such as construct hordes and zonite charges. You can process resources that you hold by dropping them into the receptacle and it is similar to using a cooking pot. No, the zonite capsules I'm good with, thank you. And what, it produces something out of it? You can't take that out here. Uh <laughs> It's a fan. Wow. Okay. What else can I use? Well, I've only got two types so far, so The horns will always make a fan. I know this is a cooking pot, this one. Is it random? I mean, if it is a gacha system, maybe it is random.
This is not the same thing. Flame emitter. Okay, so it really is a gacha system. <laughs> Interesting. Oof. There's my friend. You're here. Thanks for bringing my friend. Here's something for you. Okay. Two little turds. <laughs> Bye. All right, then. Okay. Mm huh. I'm experimenting with my green screen on the stream, and but it seems to be working well enough, I suppose. But uh. I'm still using that NVIDIA AI thing in addition to the rest because my green screen is not large enough, I suppose. Although ultimately I will have a better setup than this. fan here What the? I wasn't looking at the screen, what happened? <laughs> uh... What was that? Oh wait... Is there a... The rail is broken halfway up. Ah. But then I made this little thing with the planks, so I guess I don't have to write that minecart, but... But I suppose I'm supposed to go that way where it's cold, no? Hold on. Uh, jump is X. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't watch what I was doing. <laughs> There's a part of the rail missing. Ah well. I guess I discovered the gravity of my situation. Ha 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 ha. Can't carry any more melee weapons. That's not what I'm trying to get. It's a Zonai charge I want. Isn't there a Zonai charge in there? Oh, 
Oh, I guess there wasn't. Okay, well, I threw away a perfectly good rusty sword. If, if there is such a thing. <laughs> For nothing. Okay, well, let's turn back. Or I guess what I could have done is uh, use a hook. But that, that would only work the, on the way down, though. On that one rail that's not broken. I wonder if you can, actually. Just experimenting here a little bit. Uh, no, not like that. Yes, 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 that's it. We're going. All right, so you can do it. You can do something with that rail. It's not completely useless. <laughs> Okay, let's go that way now. So I came out of that cave. And now I have to get up there, I guess. What is that platform there? What would you do with it? Uh. Oh, oh. There's a whole bunch of stuff down there. I'm getting a bit lost, to be honest. <laughs> This game is big. Whoa, what's that? Oof. Whoa, what's that? It's... I'm too young to die! <laughs> what the... Oh! Well, I'm dead. <laughs> okay. That happened. Mm. Continue... From the last save. When did I last save? Hopefully it saved automatically, some of the stuff I did, but because otherwise... Uh, okay. Ah, oh, well. Uh... Does it still have all the stuff I did registered? Yeah, I, I think it must, it must have, yeah. Uh, the planks I said before, they're gone now. Oh well. Okay, let's uh, move on. Okay, for three minutes and a half. I should be able to resist this cold. What, do I have to climb? Up there? I see vertical surfaces are slick and hard to climb. No shit. Uh, I need to cook some stamina, r restoring stuff. Oh. 
Uh, don't... I could use more, perhaps. I don't know if this will be enough. No. Hold. Nothing else that restores uh, stamina. I don't think so. Move more quietly. Restore a bit of health. Hmm. Let's try these. Okay. Ah, but I wouldn't be able to because I'd get stuck on that thing up there. Huh. Well, I guess I just did all of that for nothing. Okay. How am I going to proceed? Mm. Or maybe I'm not supposed to go there that way. Let's see. Uh, there may be another way, but I'm not sure. I can't be sure. I'm looking towards, yeah, that part here. Uh, well, there are more rails I didn't take, so... Uh, Great Sky Island. This is too big! I, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Maybe I should look look for another shrine, because the, the, the one that I have registered on my map might not be the next one that I'm supposed to do in the, the intended order. Ah, wait, but there's Raru here, I guess. But no, this is the way I came from, isn't it? Yeah. No, this is where I came from. Okay, so it's not that way. Not That's not the way I'm supposed to go. Uh... And I came from the Ponside Cave over there. Hmm... I could try pasting together those blanks from before again. See what that does for me. Mm-hmm. This one still. And that leaves just the one here.
And how about... Here? Huh? How does that look? It seems to be holding. Alright. Unbearable cold. It says... Uh, all right. What is that? Logic would denote... Ah! Yeah? Uh... What was I supposed to do with it? What am I supposed to do with it? I want to know. <laughs> ah, but I could have grabbed it when it passed in front of me, but... Or interact with it in, in some way, but... There was a little prompt. Hold on. I'll save a video clip. And I'll pause it on that fraction of a second when it, when the message pops up. Examine? Ah, okay. It only said examine. Huh. That doesn't help. <laughs> that doesn't really help me understand what that's supposed to do. Uh... I'll blow it the other way. Might be easier. Mm, but I never know where it's gonna land. It flip flops all over the place. I don't see it. Where is it? Ah, you have to grab it out of the air for uh, a Korok seed. Okay. Okay. Well, we're on a time limit for cold resistance, so... Ah, we got something there. Is what I'm doing even any use? I don't even know if I'm going the right way. There seems to be another icy slope over that way that would block me from reaching my destination, so... I wonder if... Okay. What does that do? I dropped it. 
and Aha. Uh -huh. I've got an ice sword now. <laughs> okay. Nah, I won't be doing that. Ah, but it melts though. The icicle. Um hold and salt and pepper. Cook them. Okay. Yeah, I still s don't seem to be able to get any further, I suppose. Didn't work so bad. Freezes the enemy, prevents it from, from moving. What's not to be liked? Oh, I didn't see there was a cave here, though. Good. Uh-huh. <clears throat> okay. Into the gloomy cave we go. Discovery, bottomless cave. And I see bomb flowers. Icicle club. <laughs> Let him go. Ah, he's gone. Ember. <laughs> mm. Okay, hold on, because I keep getting notifications on my phone and. flower but like you can carry them huh I mean I'm glad they brought them back and all but <laughs> ember yeah don't fall it's a bad, bad plan. As a matter of fact, uh, yeah, there is really nothing uh, for you to go back down to. What the hell is that? Yuck. It's horrible. Uh. <laughs> uh, hold. Drop. Uh, 
Ah. Ah, no, 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 okay, okay, understood! Understood. It took me a while to realize, but... I get it now. Okay, it, it's got it in its mouth. Gonna take most of my flower bombs though, just to, just to get one. Did I get it? No, it's still not dead. Ah! Well, when it does that, I guess I can also. Uh, wait a second. There was another way. It doesn't necessarily have to be the bombs, although the, the, the bomb method is a, perhaps a, more interesting. Like-like stone. That was a like-like? Okay. A strange round stone from a like-like. Made of crystallized inner fluids. Ugh, it's a good ingredient for elixirs, if you say so. <laughs> mm-hmm. Left one. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, there was a bomb flower in the midst. Mm. I'm starting to get hungry again. Should have called it like like cave <laughs> because that's not what they call it right bottomless cave yeah is uh what, what they call it yeah flame emitter and the other one yep. opal another flame emitter sky shroom yeah, I could have picked these if I didn't hit them. Ah. It's a good thing I made several of these earlier. But hey, a bit of spice in your food, it's always good. Mm, I have to decide when I want to cook this weekend, actually, come to think of it. I want to eat something good. Something tasty. Ow.
Raw bird drumstick. Can you say pretty bird? Pretty bird. You sold our headless bird to a blind kid? Oh, wait. Where is it? There it is. No? But... Ah, okay. I thought I had to melt it because it seemed to be frozen. It was blending in the snow. Okay. Amber. Where's the shrine? Hmm, well it's up there. <clears throat> How do I get to it though? Hmm. What in the seven hells am I supposed to do? Uh, which way did I come from? From down there? Bottomless cave. Yeah, I know that's on the left. Yeah, I, I don't want to be dropping back down that way. Obviously. Yeah, that... That's the way I came out of. Yeah, 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 okay. Toasty Sky Shroom. Mm hmm. Damn it, where am I going? Up. Up there, maybe? It's that thing jumping out of the side of that thing. Uh, yeah, but I would still not be able to climb it. Uh, I can imagine a way. But, uh, huh. That might be a bit complicated. Well, I got trees. That I could use. What's that thing here? Oh, no, never mind. Can I have one? Uh, yeah, I know that that might be a little bit complicated to make it to, to get to work. Uh, no, let go. I'll cut a couple. Mm-hmm. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, that's a precarious way of gluing them together. Hold on. Okay, I think I prefer it that way. Ah, crud. Okay, I'll try elsewhere. This one might not be close enough. Uh, that one looks like it might be close enough. Don't roll off. No, don't push it. It ain't stupid if it works, I always say. <laughs> Ow. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Ah, but I have to kill them both to get the chest, I think. And now I'm cold. Ah. This one. <sighs> They're gonna kill me! Hold on. Just had an idea. They got me anyway. Mm. I couldn't get it to work. I'm short on weapons at the moment. That's the problem. Mm. And I'm starting to get low on ing on stuff to resist the, heat, the the cold as well. Uh, now I gotta. Build a thing to climb up there again. I, I, I was wondering if I could kill that bird maybe using that, that method, but <laughs> maybe not. I guess I can just eat the peppers themselves, but that only lasts 30 seconds, I think. No? Ah, uh, uh, hold on then. Come on, Rudy, you gotta find a way.
Well, it fell off. Yeah, but they're down there now. Yeah, I won't be able to interact with it until they're dead. They're too low. myself why why did I do that mm, no stop doing that <sighs> it's complicated to get to that chest If I let go of it on top of the bird, no? That should work. Come on. Grab onto it. Well, hold on. I'll jump towards it from here then. Ah, uh, no, it grabbed it now. It's gonna use it against me. I'm, I'm getting confused by all these different controls. <sighs> it's a few too many things. Too many things to keep in mind.
couldn't get it to land on the bird. I'd like to get that thing going, that, that flame spewing thing. Before it has any, b before the other guys have any chance to activate them. Ah, well, okay. They're, they're not glued in the best manner here either. Come on! Okay. But... They can still get me from a distance. So dang frustrating. Excuse me, just a second. Excuse me. I got up so late, I only had one meal today. And my body is starting to say, hey, dude, do you remember I only had one thing to eat today? That bird didn't get didn't even get hurt or anything. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's stuck, I think.
Okay, excuse me. Well, they're not looking my way, I suppose. Well, I might I might be in luck. No, I'm not in luck. Come on, Rudy. Where is it? Okay, about time. Construct bow. And what's this? A rusty broadsword. What do we have in here? Oh, just that? <laughs> it's not even worth it. Jeez. All of that for, well, just that. <clears throat> okay, what now? got the, t the the dungeon right there what I came all this way and now I have to get back down what is it exactly I have to do here I'm a bit lost and confused what's that stone what a stone axe uh, what's that there's another one Oh, I thought I saw something. Oh, well. Um. What else, then? I have no idea what I'm doing. And if I come down... Yeah, if I climb down from here, I won't be able to climb back up because it's an... It's a slippery, icy surface. How do I get to that freaking shrine? Although I guess I could paste together some more uh, tree trunks from that place here. Or even get those that I already cut down. It might save me some time. Nine minutes of resistance. Okay. Eh, well, it's a little bit too short. Hmm. 
I have a hard time doing it this time. Come on, come on. Yep, I think this time that might be okay. I think it is. I think it's stuck. Ah, look at that. We're making progress. Nice. Mm-hmm. Stone axe. Stone axe. Why is this why is this one six? Ah, it's because yeah, okay, never mind. It's a it's a sword with a, a, a stone attached to the end of it. That apple must have been here for some time. Okay. Uh No. Okay. No, I don't want to sit. Can I make fire fruit from nah, probably not. Just in case I need to Resist the cold again. I'm gonna make some more because I'm running low on these. Okay. And there's the shrine. Four hours to get this far. <laughs> Gutangbach Shrine. Da -da -da -da. Move upward through solid material and emerge on top of it. Ah, yeah, I remember seeing that from the trailers. Mm. This is the ascend ability. It lets you travel through what's directly above you to ascend through it and emerge on top of it. You'll find it quite useful in all sorts of places and situations. Mm. Use ascend and receive the blessing from the shrine. The ability to rise. Okay. Is there a chest on top of the first one? Did I miss something by going straight for this one? Yeah, I did. Should try this one first, then. I can't carry any more. Uh, throw one away, I suppose. Oh, well, this one. Drop. Did I drop it? Okay. Mm-hmm. Thank <laughs> you. 
I see. Now then. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. Hmm. Okay then. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The door into the temple of time should now open for you. Ah, it stops at three. then we'll see how it goes the floating island structure makes it a little bit hard a little bit harder to navigate I have to say I wonder if it supports the N64 controller. <laughs> that would be funny. Excuse me, I'm hungry. Okay. Oh, that's good. Okay, let's see. Mm. Mm. So I charge. So I charge. I don't. Archaic warm greaves. Ah, oh, about time.
That might just be what I need for cold, the, the little bit of cold resistance, of extra cold resistance that I needed. Just for this area. Oh yeah, I can see the limit being a, lo a lot lower now. F for where it starts to be uh, cold, for too cold for Link. <clears throat> I don't know what that supposed to be. Wait a minute. What the heck? What are these? He's gonna teach me how to use them, right? For gliding through the skies. Before I do that, I'd like to check what's up there. <coughs> My GDs today are complete. Oh, this is a rarity. It is unusual for me to receive visitors here. I assume it will require Zonai devices to descend the mountain. Would you like to use the device dispenser? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, skip it. Just show me what I got. A fan. If I put more... Ah, I get three. A wing. A zonite device that can harness lift to ride the wind. To fly farther, try ba balancing in the center of the wing. Okay. Well, he's gonna teach me, I guess. Can I cross that gap? Uh-huh. And then... No, not that. No, not that either. Uh, I'm really struggling. wings <laughs> why don't you teach me how to use the rings oh no the wings Ah, there's a dude. <clears throat> the Zonai devices were the pinnacle of our technology. We built an advanced civilization with them and flourished for many years. If you can master the use of the Zonai devices, your quest will be much easier. That's what you say, yeah, but... What am I supposed to do to get that wing to work? Ah, wait. Hit it to charge it up, maybe. It's a device, so it needs to be charged up like everything else. No? That's not it. That's not it. The heck? How does that work? Mm. I'll check up there. Yeah, but... Why do 
I need to push them? Uh, wait. Okay. Huh. Okay. Oh well, I guess I'm in the water. <laughs> Doki, the temple of time. What are we gonna do? What you gonna do? Na, 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 na. I still think it's a weird design for the Temple of Time, but, well, who am I to judge? Examine. Examine. <laughs> the closed door complete. Where is baby Zelda? Not here, huh? He lied to me. Gee, why the silent why the silent treatment? happening to me <clears throat> chick you gotta stop disappearing like that all the time
Okay. Reverse an object's movement until it goes back to where it was. You can stop the reverse movement at any time. Uh huh. Ah, recall. The ability to reverse the movement of an object through time. And Zelda has vanished as well. Hmm. What you just saw, it's a mystery even to me. Perhaps it was a sort of echo, one that reflects her sheer will. Hmm. That you've now been given this ability, no doubt it will prove important. Find Princess Zelda, updated. A goddess statue, a chic eye. How many is she gonna demand now? Three per grade. The goddess statue smiles upon you. Yeah, that's pretty good, I suppose. Okay, fine. And uh, open the door. Push! <laughs> I'm not strong enough, am I? Okay, I see what it is. This door stands as a test of your own overall vitality. You, you remain in a weakened state. You're not yet strong enough to open it. But there is one more shrine on this island. There, you can t get. There, you can get another blessing. <gasps> if you add that to the other blessings you received at the shrines and offer them to, offer them all to the goddess, you might just find your way forward after all. Mm. Let me see the pura pad. I didn't see the other shrine. The Purapad lets you travel to certain places instantly. Now you you see all the blue marks on your map. You can travel instantly to any of them. I suggest the one at the bottom of your map. Use the travel function to reach that area quickly. You will find the last of this island's shrines around there somewhere. Oh, well, if you're telling me where exactly it is. Uh, well, let's do that, I guess. <clears throat> and after I've been able to get through it all, I think I'll stop here for today. That was some good amount of progress, I think. Told me to use fast travel. I should definitely do it. They seem to have recycled that animation. <laughs> What's the matter, you? Uh, wait, I'm back at the beginning. Ah, hey, wait. You can go back. No, I guess. 
No, I guess this is a uh, completely blocked. Okay. I guess that's where I woke up. Ah. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Ah, I had to jump. Well, it would be better if I could climb up there, though. Wouldn't it? Ha, 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 you can't. Well, other than these things, apparently I can't interact with anything. Oh, no, okay. Managed to get it to work. Well, there's a shrine. Hello. This is a crystal refinery. I can take your crystallized charges and use them to produce energy wells. Energy wells? An energy well can increase the capacity of the energy cell you are carrying. The increased capacity will allow you to use Zonai devices for a longer period. I can produce these energy wells for you if you bring me crystallized charges. Shall I begin production, or would you like me to explain crystallized charges? I know what they are. Get producing, I guess. Ah, I need a hundred. Ah, okay, fine. The mines on this island have nearly run dry. I doubt there is enough left to produce an energy well, but there is more to be had. Check the distant, distant depth of the world below that is is it that is its original source okay are you turning this into some kind of minecraft you can craft stuff by putting putting them together uh, i know miyamoto said once that he wishes he had created minecraft he wishes he had come up with the idea <laughs> Because the concept is so popular these days. Like Minecraft, Roblox, these sorts of things. Terraria, I guess, is kind of in the same league of uh, dig, mine, craft stuff. Perhaps. Although I've never actually played Terraria myself. No, 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 no. Ah, I can't. Can't do it. Like this. Go. Do it. That's a pretty cool uh, power to have.
Okay, sure. Right, there we go, we made it. Back to the goddess statue now, I suppose. Hmm. Visitor to the Shrine of Light, that which imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. You have done well to reach this place. You have done well, Lord Vader. Light of Blessing, a crystal that glows with a light that purges the ancient evil and purifies with its radiance. May the Light of Blessing grant you the strength you seek. <laughs> Making a campfire. To start a campfire, simply set some wood ablaze. You can use a torch or some flint, etc. etc. That's not what I mean. I want to look at the map. That's, that's the one, yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Well, I picked the one that seemed to be the closest. Uko Shrine. Where's the way down? Oh, it's the it's the clouds casting the the shadows or what? The sun is right there, and the shadow doesn't seem to be moving in real time. So I don't know. Huh? There seems to be an island at the very top up there. Anyway. They do seem to move in real time. On Link's shadow, it wasn't that easy to see, but... Or oh, what? It only updates the position of the shadow of Link? Because look, Link's shadow is... M well, not exactly in the right position here, right? Compared to where the shadow is being cast by the shrine. I don't know. Is this shadow only using like a, a static light source? While the environment itself doesn't? I don't know. Or maybe it only updates it after Link moves or something. I do not know. Because I feel like Link's shadows should be moving just as fast as the others, but uh, it doesn't seem to. Seem seems to remain firmly in place. I don't know. It's a mystery to me. <laughs> Where's 
Where's the Temple of Time? Ah. Behind me. Should I have cooked them, by the way, uh, to make something that allows me to run faster? Mm. Don't know. Alright, will you give me an extra heart? I will grant you power. A heart container. I guess it, it won't let you pick stamina in this case. Because you need the, the extra heart container to get past the gate. And bring peace to the world. And now I have what it takes. <laughs> Please don't leave me in this weakened state. Zuluda Hime. Ah, good. I see you have managed to open the door. You haven't fully recovered yet, but that is to be expected. We're almost beyond saving. By visiting the shrines and receiving their blessings, you have mitigated some of the corruption's effects. Our time together has been brief. I am so happy that we finally met. You are exactly as Zelda said. How's your adventure going? What happened to his hand? Apparently he lost his arm and part of his arm is uh, replaced with something else now. Now it is up to you. It is up to me to what? To what? <laughs> Tell me. You'll figure it out. Basically. Uh, all right. To save everything. Yep. This one. Okay. 
I do it here? Okay. Uh, I have both. I suck at Smash Brothers. I'm decent at Mario Kart. <laughs> Actually, I never finished uh, the uh, Sma uh, Smash, Broth Smash Brothers Ultimate on Switch. It's one of those games that I never finished. Now, Mar Mario Kart, I'm decent. But yeah, they're fun, yeah, that's for sure. Oh, it's the same it's the same sound that Five makes in Skyward Sword. That, yeah. Huh. They're not gonna bring back Fi, right? What? What? I give it to her? For fixing? And she took my sword! <laughs> Give it back! Thief! Ooh! Dragons! I think it may start to make a bit a bit of sense why they chose to remaster a Skyward Sword if there's gonna be so many ties between this game and Skyward Sword. Woohoo! Link! 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 You must find me. Tell me what it looks like where you are! <laughs> no, I guess it's up to me to figure it out once again. Because giving me crucial information might make a bit too much sense. Alright. Uh, capsules, capsules, capsules. Ding, ding. What is it? Uh. Oh, never mind. Uh, I got a portable wing. You can't take that out here. Ah, oh. are you kidding me? Ah, oh. okay. So you cancel, pick a different power. Okay, how about that? Is it okay? It won't glide. <sighs> Frustrating. Why won't you glide? I don't know how to use these things. The map. Uh... I 
can't get these things to glide. Oh yeah, but now it leaves without me. <laughs> Can't get it to work. Hold on then. Uh, how am I gonna do this? Like this? Okay. I can't call it back where it is now. There it is. Okay. There. <laughs> that was complicated. Link, find me. Where? <laughs> I don't know. Ah, wait. Where that... Where that yellow dot is? To the kingdom of Hyrule, find Princess Zelda. Yeah, well, I don't know. I don't know what that is. Or maybe it's finished already? No. You didn't find Princess Zelda on the Sky Island where you awoke. When you touched the light in the Temple of Time, you felt her presence. However, faintly as a voice rang out in your mind, Link, you must find me. Where is Princess Zelda? Was there anything more she was trying to tell you? I don't know. We had a bad connection. Her phone ran out of juice before she could tell me. <laughs> what in the name of Hylia? It's quite pretty though. Look at that. Mmm. Looks nice. Okay, a little bit to the left, Link. To the kingdom of Hyrule. Where am I supposed to go? Down that way? What is it? What is it? Hey, don't run out of juice now. Why is it? Why is it doing that? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not there yet. I'm only gonna die if you f if ah <laughs> ah <laughs> I'm dead. Uh, oh man! Oh man! Oh boy! I'm gonna crash down. <laughs> no, dive. Uh, I don't know. I can steer myself a little bit. There's water over there, but I'm too far. It's too late. <laughs> Go back up. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes! Fuck! Yeah, I could have steered myself to uh, to to go and land in water. Although technically, if you fell from that sort of height in water, you'd die anyway because uh, the the speed at which you hit the water, it's water is might as well be stone, and it might m would be just the same. But you should have turned into a lasagna. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, uh, and now I gotta do that thing again. That's so annoying. Uh, okay. In that direction, sort of. Oh well, okay, I, I handled this a little bit better this time. I think it's it's uh, just a matter of how long you use it. You might not be allowed to use it for longer than a certain period. 
I see a little floating island over over in that direction. I'll try going that way then. See what it is. I don't know if I'll make it all the way there, though. If I had a paraglider! Okay, I need water. I need water, but I don't know where to find any. Uh, 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 ha, 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 ha. Okay, water, water, water. I'm gonna die again. Uh, there's water over there, but I don't think I can reach it. Yeah, no. <laughs> I'm too far. <laughs> Would hitting water kill you too? Uh, in the game, no, I don't think so. I think you'd survive, but, uh... <laughs> easier said than done so far. <sighs> Let's try it again! Yeah, I need... more surface. Actually, no, I didn't have to do all that time thing. Should I just focus on just reaching the ground and not try to travel the longest distance possible? Well, there seems to be water running all around the castle, so let's try to reach that, I suppose. I'm not gonna waste any flight time veering left or right. I'll just try to... Travel the longest distance possible. And even then, I don't think I'll be able to make it. I don't seem to be moving fast enough. What's that in the corner? Well, with me in the way, you can't see it very well, but I think it's telling me my coordinates. X and Y, and the altitude? Find me some water! Find me some water! There is none! There is none! Okay. Uh, well, I'm dead, I guess. <laughs> Zbloosh. Alright. Let's try it again, and I'll try to land in the first pond of water that I can find. I, d I just want to reach solid ground in one piece. That's all I should focus on. <laughs> Okay. From here. It's like, mm, there's not much in this game that's self-explanatory. You kind of have to experiment with things and get to know them. Okay, there's a pond right there. Try to go for it. If the game will let me. Get the nose of the bird to point to it. There we go. Uh, well, I turned a bit more, a bit too much. There we go. Yeah, more or less. I think this is water, right? It looks like water to to me from here. Oh, 
Are we on top of it yet or not? Okay. Well, there we go. I survived. Back to Hyrule. Yeah, and I figured let's not land too close, uh, too far from the edge of the water because I also need to survive the swim and not drown. <laughs> All right, I guess uh, now we have this huge kingdom to explore. How do you save? Ah, but I guess it saved when I when I landed. Okay, that's that thing here. Looked a bit like a Sheikah shrine from uh, from afar, but you know what? I think it might have been, but ah no, no, never mind. That's a t totally different shape. Ah well, there's a shrine right there. Let's uh, l let's go for it. Actually, let's see if we can can't find any more. Mm. And mark them on the map. Oh, hello, you. <laughs> What the? Oh, I thought I thought it had a, a sword in a, it planted in its uh in its head or something. I guess it's a horn. Hmm. Well, I can't see any other from here. There are many things floating in the sky. Ooh, what's that over there? New type of enemy? Oh, yeah. A giant moblin? Moblin? Or whatever their name is? Yeah, these were not in the previous one. <laughs> they even seem to have the same kind of necklaces... Well, or maybe a bit fancier looking, I guess, as those in uh, Wind Waker. When you kill them, they drop a necklace with a skull on it. And here, it seems to be the same kind of necklace, but with like 10 skulls on it instead. Because <laughs> I guess they're a bigger variant or something. Alright, how about it? Let's make this the final thing I'll do tonight. Ah, oh, wait a second. There's another one over there in the distance. Let's mark it as well. And isn't there another one? Ah, oh, but no, that's the one I that's the one I just marked. Ah. All right. Any other? Yes, indeed. Well, that should be enough for now, I think. Okay, good. Josin Shrine. Okay, let's move in. How do I fill in the map this time around? If there are no Sheikah to towers to sync with. Shape rotation. Shape rotation. Okay, a gap I can't cross. 
and uh, I think the exit might be over that way. Okay. Pretty simple. There we go. Next shape, I suppose. Hmm. Shape must be the other way. Yeah, okay. I can see how I'm supposed to do it, but, uh... When here, it's just for a chest, though. Ah, shoot. Come on. Ah! Of course, they had to make them stuff that it, that you can't uh, climb and and uh, stick to. What you can't? Uh. Huh. Hmm. Like this, more like. Yeah. Okay. If I could move it <laughs> uh, through, through the top, that would be easier, but. Easy is not what they were going for, is it? Ah, but it seems impossible! Uh, is there another one? Or am I not? There has to be an angle that I just can't picture right now. I think I've got it, sort of, but... Hmm. No. That's not the one. Ah, like this? No. It has to be sort of that at that at that angle, but Yeah, that's exactly how it should be, but flip ninety degrees. Ah <laughs> Took me long enough. Alright. I 
think it's something along those lines, but I'm not so sure. Yes, kind of like that, I guess. Okay. No chest in the back. Alright, that'll be it for today. Quite happy with the game so far. It's been fun. Thank you, Nintendo, also for releasing it on the one weekend where I don't have to work. That's nice. Thank you very much. Because that mean I can't that means I can geek out for the rest of the weekend. <laughs> we offer this slide that will cleanse you of evil. Light of Blessing, a crystal that glows with a light that purges ancient evil and purifies with its radiance. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alrighty. Um, is it, am I wrong? I think the shrines in Breath of the Wild had different looking mummies of ancient Sheikah people so they did not all look the same but here it looks like they all have the exact same statue though so there's a less variation i guess in that sense uh, that's a bit of a shame i will field chasm don't know what that is we'll check that out next time i've been playing for about five hours that's cool okay people thank you for watching then i'll see you next time which should be tomorrow uh Possibly already in the afternoon, but maybe not the early afternoon. We'll see how it goes, because I, I will probably be sleeping in late uh, in the morning. And then I'll have some shopping to do uh, before shops close uh, the next day on Sunday. Then I'll have to come home, make dinner. And uh, after all is said and done, I guess, uh, that's only when I will be able to start streaming. So thank you for watching, people. Take care. See you next time. Hopefully I get to see you next time. Bye-bye.